In the industry today, there are two kinds of coding camps slash philosophies when it comes to API creation. Design first style and code first style. In SnapLogic parlance, it's a top-down or bottom-up approach to creating APIs from the SnapLogic IIP platform. We have the traditional route, the code first style available previously, to create APIs by beginning with the pipeline and then invoking them through tasks. In the May 2021 release, we introduced the other coding practice, the design first style, which is getting your API contract out first and then adding the business logic to the API. To this effect, we now offer a way to import slash use an open API specification to define the purpose or the API structure in the IIP platform and then layer on the details about the service implementation. With the May 2021 release, the SnapLogic API management solution also has a newly added API manager console, which is a single pane of view for all APIs created through the new approach. Open API specification, as you know, is an open source format utilized in producing, describing, consuming, and visualizing APIs. To create a new API from an open API specification, click on the plus icon. You can upload the spec in a YAML or JSON format. To create the API, update the description, pick the right tags, also specify the server or the SnapLex on which you want the API implementations to run, then hit Create. When an open API spec is imported to the API management solution, the platform on the background creates the API and version folder asset structure. Once the API is created, you can click on it to get details. You will see two more tabs, one for versions and one for permissions. When you click on a specific version, you will get the version details. You can also see the version-specific assets and permissions. In the Assets tab, you can see things such as the open API spec that you imported. Another key asset that is auto-generated for every version is the pipeline, which is mapped to a unique path in the open API specification file. A scaffold for the pipeline slash pipelines based on the path and operations defined in the API specification. The generated pipeline has an HTTP router snap with the HTTP methods defined under the path node for each API endpoint. Adding the implementation for the API is now as easy as attaching the right connectors or snaps to perform that complex business logic to the corresponding pipelines. You can also see details on the underlying task for this API. You can get details on the task URL, SnapLex it runs on, etc. A user can create new versions of the APIs by clicking on the plus icon. You can then import a spec that conforms to the new version. Specify the version and the SnapLex. The platform makes it easy to make modifications and enhancements to different versions of the API independently. The API and versions created follow the same project hierarchy structure, thus making it accessible like any other resource in the platform. SnapLogic API Management Solution allows you to secure your APIs through an extensive list of pre-built policies from authentication, access and traffic management, and transformation to the APIs and its versions. For my Pet Store API, let's add a client throttling policy to this version too. Through this policy, I will limit the request to 10 per hour. Now, if you go to My Pet Store API through the breadcrumbs at the top, you can see the API policies applied at the API level. Here I will add Autonomous Authenticator Policy at the API level. Policies can be inherited from three hierarchical levels in the API management solution. Policies can be set at the org level, the API project space level, and version slash folder level. For a given API version, you can click on the View Applied Policies to see the policies applied to a specific version of an API. Then, by going to the Hierarchy tab, you can see the nested tree structure of applied policies to determine what policies are enabled for a given API version. Thanks for watching this video. To learn more about SnapLogic API management, please visit snaplogic.com.